Alright, so it is day 49 of 75 hard. It is 11.20. We've already had our first meal of eggs, four eggs, and two bananas. We left out the egg whites because we drank them. But today we're going to be doing all of our regular stuff like reading and stuff. I woke up at 8, got up, fell back asleep. I've done that for the past like week. And I went to bed early so I could get up early. But it just didn't work. So I'll keep doing that. I'm trying to get back on my schedule uh, like I was on my competition prep where I'll wake up at 6.30 a.m. And go to bed at like 10.30. So it's kind of like just a lot earlier. I'll get everything done early. And it'll be a lot less stressful. But today is hamstrings, calves, and lower back. Like one exercise of the lower back. I'm going to be taking my new DMAE stuff. Like some pretty serious focus ingredient. Uh, I'm going to be mixing it with alkaline. That should be exciting. If you want to help support me with alkaline and stuff. Like in the back. My alkaline code is SAMM to save you 10%. And my fuel meals check out the meal prep company I'm with. Use code SAM30 to save 30%. <clears throat> and this is your reminder to pray, help someone in need, live humbly, spread the gospel, and put a smile on someone's face today. You never know how it could affect someone, change someone, or save someone's life. But uh, yeah, that's how the day's going so far. Took care of all of our animals and stuff. Uh... We got some, we got to go by the bank and stuff like that today. Uh, just little stuff. And then we edited all of our videos yesterday. So let me show you the video we're about to post for our daily 75 hard videos for TikTok. I want you to take it personal. And my personal question to you is why not you? You've got the brains. You can make decisions. You can study the plan. You can change your life. You can grow immensely in the next few years. You can make your dreams come true. You can build a financial wall around your family. Nothing can get through. You can become healthy. You can become powerful. Why not you? Hope you all enjoyed that little edit I made for today. Um, it's obviously day 43 that I'm posting, but today's actually 49. I recorded a week before. I posted anything just in case one day I got sick or anything like that. So I'd always be posting every single day. But uh, yeah, uh, I just got a notice on my phone from the gym I go to. Uh, it's very understandable. Uh, uh, they're not letting people use tripods because it's a very, a lot of the college, people who go to Liberty University, it's like college where I live. A lot of those kids from Liberty University go to my gym. And obviously, I use a tripod myself because I can't afford someone to film me every single day for 75 days straight. But they're just uh, putting it to where you, during like the busiest hours of the gym where everybody's getting off work and just trying to get their workout in. They're just saying, just don't be using your tripod, which is perfectly understandable. But in other words, someone or multiple people have just been like hogging space with tripods. I do my best. And if you're out there, you should do your best to hide your tripod. Just don't care if someone gets in the way. I mean, stuff like this happens, and like, if one person does it, then it kind of ruins it for the rest of the people. So I won't be able to go to the gym till like 8 o'clock, either before 4 p.m., which I can't because I'm watching my brother. And I'm just going to have to wait till 8 p.m. to work out. So I'm going to have to be doing that for now on, Monday through Friday, of course, because uh, that's when most people go to the gym. But... I mean, you got to do what you got to do. I mean, if people are hogging your space in your gym, wouldn't you do the same thing? But kind of like a little update on my gym. And if you see me in my videos when it's going to be always pretty much pitch black now, that's why. But uh, yeah, that's your sign to uh, kind of like pay attention to how you're uh, holding yourself up in the gym. I mean, I like I train really hard. I grunt and stuff. Don't lie. I'm not going to lie to you, but that doesn't mean I'm just going to start flexing on people on a tripod. But and if I come off on that way to y'all, I don't try to. But 
if you have a tripod in the gym, just try to be aware of setting your tripod across the gym and recording yourself in a line where everybody walks, so where they have to walk around. Don't be that. But, yeah, that's kind of how today's going. It kind of sucks, though, having that news because I was really getting back to my schedule of waking up early, going to the gym at like 6, getting home at 8, but... It's alright. Uh, we gotta adjust for the for the dreams. And uh, yeah. Hope you guys are enjoying this video so far. And I'll see you all at the next meal. Alright, so we have our second and third meal combined today. Uh, we got apple, honey crisp, I mean Fuji apple. Then we got what is that? Oh. Then we got a toasted bagel, blueberry bagel. Um, with strawberry fruit spread on it, and then we got toasted whole wheat bread with tuna and mustard. That's like the food portion of it, and then we have a protein shake with collagen, creatine, and a scoop in like three quarters of alkaline uh, PB and Games protein powder. Code Sam, save ten percent. Code Sam, save ten percent. But uh. Let's uh, drink this, get this down first. I didn't shake this up well at all. I can still see clumps at the top. So I'm gonna shake it up real quick. There we go. All right, so that is the shakedown. Gonna pray before we eat, be thankful for the food on our plate, and I'll see y'all when I'm reading the book. Alright, we have our fourth meal chicken and rice. I'm gonna down this, and it's 3 30, so we've still got a pretty long while until we go to the gym. But, I'm gonna read a uh, the bodybuilding encyclopedia for our book today. We're gonna pray before we eat. Be thankful for the food on our plate. And uh, see y'all after. All right, so we have our pre-workout meal. It is 7 p.m. now. Got ground beef and rice. And then we have our rice crispy, a homestyle rice crispy. It's got like the little marshmallow bits as well. Uh, this by itself is um, 130 calories. We're going to eat this, and then we're going to go to the gym. So, yeah. Hope you all guys are enjoying these videos. Um, I look a little goofy right now because my hair is long. We're going to need to shave and do a bunch of stuff, like grooming-wise, like I need to get this cut down, but we're going to eat this, pray before we eat, and I'll see you all for this juicy leg workout. We're going to have some crazy DMA stuff, so we're going to be going wild, and since it's going to be a pretty empty gym, since it'll be like 8 o'clock because the tripod ban, uh, if you skip through early the earlier part of the video, we have a tripod ban now from 4 to 8 p.m., the busiest time of my gym hours, so now i got to wait till really late at night, but we're going to still get that work in. Grateful to be able to go to the gym. Some people don't have that opportunity and that blessing. So be grateful for the blessings you have. And uh, see y'all then. You just have to show up for show us. Up. Yes. Show up? Yeah. I fucking showed up for you. I showed up. I was standing there for you. Oh, fuck Look where got me. So this is my fault then. Yeah!
10:30, day 49 of 75 hard going down in the books hope you guys enjoyed it was a very well needed workout i it was the first time in like probably a year that afterwards i could barely stand up because my legs were shaking but that's a good sign that i had a great workout controlled the weight and uh yeah if you guys want to help support me use my codes like i said earlier in the video and this is your reminder to pray help someone i need live humbly spread the gospel, and put a smile on someone's face today. You never know how it could affect someone, change someone, or save someone's life. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.